Valero offers two alternative fuels, corn-based ethanol and renewable diesel out of the Diamond Green Diesel joint venture we have with Darling Ingredients. They spent a couple years getting the project together, and on June 30, 2013, Diamond Green Diesel produced its first gallon of renewable diesel. Diamond Green is really a refining unit, basically hydro-treating and isomerization. So we've brought a lot of excellence to that. We're leaning on the refinery to operate it. What's most interesting is the greenhouse gas savings that we have. Renewable diesel produces 15% of the greenhouse gases that a mineral diesel would produce. Renewable diesel, it's kind of a wide open game there. If you're trying to meet a low carbon mandate, we think renewable diesel is the best fuel out there Renewable diesel is definitely different than biodiesel. What renewable diesel is, basically take waste products. We're taking beef tallow, used cooking oil. Products that would otherwise be put into landfills. And we make diesel fuel out of it. It has a high cetane number, which is kind of like the octane in gasoline, which means it's kind of what gives you the get up and go in your car. In the United States, diesel is a fuel used for transportation of goods, trucking and commerce. So it's a really exciting time to be a Diamond Green Diesel. It was recently approved that by 2022, we'll be producing 675 million gallons a year. So we'll be more than doubling our capacity. We're going to be close to 50,000 barrels a day. That's gonna put us at the second largest renewable diesel producer in the world. What's interesting about Diamond Green Diesel is that we actually plug into the existing infrastructure that the industry uses already. You don't have to build a special pipeline system for us. You don't have to modify your engines. You don't have to have new filling stations. We are complementary to what's already being produced and sold, not only in the United States, but throughout the world.